Hey guys, Brendan here. Uh, just doing a quick update of my 29 gallon salt water tank. Uh, it's looking good, as you can, well, uh, it's, it's looking really blue on camera, but it's like purple in real life. But as you can see, my clownfish is right here, he's doing good, he's swimming around, it's night time. And my blue damsel's back there blending in with the lights. Uh, I don't think you guys can see this, but I got, oh yeah, yes you can, I got hair allergy, I got it real bad. So today I decided to do something about it, and I went down to my local fish store. Actually, I went to Petco, just because my local fish store isn't open on Sundays or Mondays. Ooh, what is going on? So I went to Petco, and they actually have a pretty nice selection of saltwater fish over there. So I picked up two Mexican turbo snails. You can see one right there, and the other one's right there, along with my hermit crab. Who's right back there. He's real tiny, but they've been doing a good job. They've been cleaning up um, the rocks and everything like that, getting all the algae off. And, you know, I'm just starting to notice, every day I'm just starting to notice more and more life in this tank. As you can tell, I'm not using my canopy anymore. I kind of like the way the open top feels. Um, I feel like that, that canopy is just, it's so hard to feed them with that on there because it's literally, I have to cram the little thing that I use to feed them like in this tiny little crack and I don't really have like any way to kind of control how I feed them so now I'm just going to keep it like this um, so that way I can you know regulate their feedings a little bit more and it's easier on me as well too so uh, another thing is my sump uh, I kind of got I guess held back I was going to actually planning on building the entire thing this weekend but uh, ended up not being able to do that uh, but Probably going to, you know, start working on it this week. Um, I'm actually, well, my major plan is, I know this sounds crazy, I just kind of started this tank, but I want to sell this tank and sell that tank over there and then buy a 75-gallon and start that up as my reef tank. But I was looking at it a little bit more today, and I think I'm actually going to invest some more time into this tank just so I can get a better grip on you know the whole saltwater thing before I you know try and do something too big and crazy so I'm actually gonna you know go ahead and finish my overflow and um, build my sump and everything like that so that way when I go to do the 75 gallon you know I know exactly how to do it I'm not you know guessing or anything like that but um, so yeah if there's any other things you guys recommend for a cleanup crew uh, I'm planning on getting a coal banded shrimp because I really like the shrimps. Uh, I already got my hermit crab, my two turbo snails. I'm probably going to get either two, maybe even three more turbo snails. Maybe even some more hermit crabs because that actually, believe it or not, was the biggest one that they had there. He was the biggest one and he's absolutely tiny, but I could find some smaller ones and just put them in there. I think if I had maybe 10 of those small ones they're really really cheap for them tiny ones but if I can get like 10 of those in there and then just kind of sell them off or move them to the bigger tank once I have that going so uh, but yeah other than that the lights are doing great it's really bright it's really cool looking um, my coral is looking pretty good too actually that one piece back there fell over and I haven't you know had time to stick my hand in there and uh, put it back up or find a better spot for it rather but yeah that's pretty much all that um, check out my other videos on my do-it-yourself overflow that I made it uh, it's working pretty cool I like it I like the way it works I might have to make a few adjustments to uh, suit the needs of my water level in this tank but other than that you know it's pretty awesome so Go ahead and check it out. Check out my channel. Um, keep watching all my YouTube videos, guys. I'm going to have more updates on this 29-gallon reef. Hopefully more in the daytime so you guys can actually see it better. But, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks for watching. All right. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.